Hello, I'm Jamie Roberts and I'm here at Barnsley College and I've been going through some different sorts of finger style techniques. Um, I've just been looking at a little sequence that uses sort of rhythmic style of finger picking and I'm just going to quickly go through a few of the different techniques alternative to those that I've just gone through that you might want to practice to improve on this style. So in the last one we're looking at as a main technique, they all tend to be based around this sort of slap of the strings. So before we were looking at the slap picking up into the index finger, the thumb, and then, you, then either your middle finger or your ring finger, whichever. So it should sound like that. So that's one, one exercise you want to practice round and round to be, till you can do it at, at quite a fast pace to get that, that sort of... That sort of really sort of funky beat sounding. But also you want to practice it landing on different strings so that your index finger can pick up on different strings. So there I was, I was landing it to pick up on the G string with my thumb on the D string, my ring finger on the top string. You want to practice it so you can land on different strings, just alternate it. Okay, so that's that one. But on top of that, you want to practice other things. It's still based around that, the slap of the strings, but again, with the pickup, it's usually with your index finger, but, but this time, instead of doing your thumb first, you want to try it with using either your, index, um, either your middle finger or your ring finger second. So it's basically the reverse order of what you were doing before, so it should sound like... So slowly, if you, if you can see. So again, just practice it landing on different strings. And also, what I found quite useful is doing stuff in compound time, in, as in 6-8 or 9-8 time. So you use, you're still using the same slap effect, but you're just going to pick up to either pick up with the index finger but then just either your thumb or, or one of your other fingers for the, for the third note because obviously you've got one note less because it's groups of three as opposed to groups of four so if you listen to this it's um so that was just using these two fingers just the slap the index finger and then my fourth finger, so. And then try it with your thumb as opposed to your ring finger. And again, just practice it, different combinations, different strings to land on. And what also sounds quite good is actually doing it on the same string, so you're picking up, so you're gonna use your, your index finger first and then your thumb, but actually on the same string. So this is just to demonstrate how you can use this to, to make something incredibly simple sound quite good. Um, it's just an open E chord and we're going to do the pick up on the G so it goes like this. So the actual pick up isn't actually playing a note, all it's doing, I've got it muted with my thumb and it's there just as a rhythmic effect really so. There you go, just, just practice some of these techniques over and over until you, you sort of develop that style and then you can just mess around. It's, once you've got that, you can make something really simple with your left hand sound really quite complicated just by using your right hand. So it's just a case of messing around with it really. <laughs>